Sometimes, when you try to delete an email from Outlook, a notification pops up saying the deleted items folder is unavailable. It's really frustrating and so annoying. Hi there, we are going to show you some tips on how to solve the problem where Outlook says the deleted items folder is unavailable when you want to delete an email. But, before we are up and running with our video, tap on the subscribe button below. Although there are a few different ways to achieve this, we'll focus on the most common and the easiest ones. Method 1. Subscribe to the missing folder for IMAP accounts. You receive an email notification that your deleted items folder is unavailable. After a quick search, you realize the issue is with your Outlook account. You try to fix the problem but with no success. Finally, you decide to subscribe to the missing folder for the IMAP accounts service. Within minutes, your deleted items folder is working as it should be. Let's now see how it is done. Open Outlook and choose the Inbox folder. With the right click on the Inbox folder, click on IMAP folders. The dialog box IMAP folders will come up. Tap on the Query button and select the Deleted Items folder. Tap on Subscribe. You can also double check the subscription to the Deleted Items folder by checking the folders within the Subscribe tab. Method 2. Create the missing Deleted Items folders manually. We did some research and found that this issue can also happen if the folder is too large. Outlook will automatically delete old items from the folder in order to make space, but if there are too many items, they will become unavailable. To fix this error, follow the steps below to create the missing deleted items folders. Choose New Folder under the Folder tab of your Outlook. Select Deleted Items as the new folder name, then click OK. Following this, you may have to subscribe to the new deleted items folder. For this, you can recap the previous method. Outlook users often face the deleted items folder is unavailable error. If you have attempted both methods and are still unable to recover your items, then you may have a damaged OST file. In this case, it would be helpful to use a professional tool like Kernel for OST to PST Converter. This tool has been tested and trusted by many professionals and can help you in recovering your lost data. No matter what the size of your OST file is, this tool will help you recover deleted messages and attachments. Users can search for OST files in their specified system drive using the advanced search option. Also, the recovered emails can be stored in many file formats as given on your screen. We hope you are no longer facing this error in Outlook. Do not forget to click the like button and leave your comments below. Find out more about the tool from the link below. Have a nice day.